Hey everyone, it's Mar Shlomo again. I want to continue the story about when Moshe grew up in the palace. So while he was in that palace, he found out he was Jewish. And when he looked around and he saw that all the other Jewish people were slaves, he felt that something wasn't right about it. And he figured he would do what he can to help out the Jewish people. So he was slowly just like watching them and then maybe helping here and there. Uh, and then one day he saw that one of the Egyptian slave masters, one of the Egyptian soldiers, was about to hit a Jewish person. And he ended up killing, Moshe ended up killing that Egyptian soldier. And he, he looked around, he saw no one was coming, he killed him and buried him in the sand. Maybe he was going around probably like the next day or soon after, and he saw two Jewish people fighting with each other. And he goes, Jewish people, he goes, why are you hitting each other? And they said, why? What are you going to do? Are you going to kill us like you killed that soldier? And when Moshe found out that um, people must know about what he did, he decided to run away from Mitzrayim. He ran away from Egypt. And when he went, he went to a place called Midian. While he was at Midian, he ended up um, meeting his father, his future father-in-law. He ended up getting, having a wife, having two children, and he was a shepherd. And that's how he was living his life. He was a shepherd. And one day he was walking. All of a sudden he sees a bush and it was a burning bush. The bush was on fire. It's like a thorn bush on fire. Big deal. So a bush is on fire. That happens all the time, maybe in some places. So the bush was on fire and um, all, he goes closer. He goes, this is so weird. This bush is on fire, but it's nothing's happening to it. It's not burning. It's just on fire, but it's not like turning into ashes and disappearing. He went closer to see it. And then while he was there, he hears something. And I'll tell you what, coming up. See you soon.